This is a remote control crane that uh, helps the workers pick up boats from the water. Boats that require uh, repairs at the bottom, clean up, painting, all those things uh, uh, need to be pulled out of the water and moved on shore like this boat and the process uses this type of crane in case you never saw one of those things actually this uh, particular crane is being operated by the operator which is uh, right on a little cabin here uh, I've seen one that uh, uses a portable remote control and now the uh, the boat is coming uh, next to this dock she has uh, some slings and now they leave the boat with the passengers with the workers I'm getting a better view here This is a search and rescue team They see they put the slings underneath And here it go, the, the boat goes up And this is a marina, lots of older boats, uh, lots of fishing vessels, sailboats. I only been into a sailboat once. A, uh, a friend, a neighbor has a sailboat and uh, he gave me a ride. Of course, uh, I, assisting, I assisted him with uh, some navigation uh, equipment he installed by himself. Uh, it was interesting, but was not really uh, out on a wide open ocean with uh, wind. And it was just a short ride around Vancouver area. So now they are going up. This is a powerful boat. It is a two engine, 250 pores uh, each one. They will do some uh, repairs and uh, they will install a, a new equipment, a new transducer uh, at the bottom of this uh, this boat. It's way bigger than my little Zodiac. It's like, this is a pro type of boat. I like to see this type of stuff. That's in case you never saw how they get these uh, boats out of the water and how they put it in the water. So you can't have a boat like this one. Let's say this is a sailboat belonging to the Stray Marine shop, 